Hey there! Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're going to tackle a common issue that many of you might have encountered, how to fix unable to delete a folder error. If you've ever been frustrated by this message popping up, don't worry. We've got you covered with a simple solution. Today, I will tell you our multiple methods to solve this problem. So, let's get started. First things first. Right-click on the folder that's causing you trouble. When you click on it, a menu will appear. In the menu click on the last option. That is Properties. Now, you will see multiple tabs at the top. From these, navigate to the Security tab, and New Format will appear. Now, you will see Advanced option. So, click on Advanced option. After that, you will see three tabs at the top. Make sure that you have selected Permissions tab from these. Now, in this format, you will see an option that says Enable Inheritance. Click on it. After that, click on the Apply button, and then click on the OK button. And after that, again click on the OK button. Now, check if your problem is solved then will good. And if not, then I have another method. Now, again right click on the folder. And again click on the properties. And again select security tab at the top. And then click on the advanced. After that, this time, click on change option that is in the blue color. When you click on it, a new format will appear. Now, you will see an empty field. Enter your username in the field. If you don't know your username, then click on the search bar and search settings and then click on the settings. A new format will appear and you will see multiple options. In the options, click on the accounts. When you click on it, now blow the profile picture. You will see your username. Now go back. My username is administrator. So, I type administrator in the field. When you typed in, click on check names button that is near the field. Once your name is verified, click on OK. Now, you will see an option that says replace owner on subcontainers and objects. Click on it to check the box. When you checked it, then hit the apply button. And then again click on the OK. Lastly, Check replace all child object permission entries with inheritable permission entries from the object. When you checked it, then hit the apply. Now, confirm with a yes, and then click on the OK, and then again click OK again to close the window. Now, again check. I hope your problem will be solved. If not, surprisingly, I have another method to solve this problem. The first step of this method is to try changing permissions. Oftentimes, this error is due to a permission issue. Here's what you do. Right-click on the folder you want to delete. Then select Properties from the menu that pops up. Now, tap on the Security tab at the top. After that, click on the Edit button. Now, under the Group and Usernames, select your username, and then in the permission section, make sure to uncheck all the boxes for deny, and check all the boxes for allow. Finally, click on the apply, and then tap on OK, and again tap on the OK. Now, again try deleting the file or folder again. If that doesn't work, I have a last method. Finally, if all else fails, try rebooting your system. Sometimes, a simple restart can work wonders. After rebooting, try deleting the file or folder again. If I try to delete folder, you can see, my folder has successfully deleted. And there you have it. Four simple methods to fix the unable to delete folder issue on Windows. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching.